Good evening, everybody. I'd like to thank you all for joining us tonight. My name is Kayla. I am one of our placement coordinators here, as well as helping out with admissions. So I'm going to be hosting tonight. We do have a special guest with us tonight, Donnie Graves with Windy Hill Foliage. We'll get to him in just a few minutes. We're going to go through a few things first. Uh, still got people. Some, I see people are signing on still. We're going to go through a little bit of the housekeeping here, um, just to kind of go through what you guys can expect in our webinar tonight. You guys might be joining us from your desktop computer or a laptop, maybe even a smartphone or a tablet. You're going to see several icons at the top of your screen or on the side of your screen. The first one's going to be your microphone. Everybody right now is in the listen only mode, but we will open up those microphones here in just a little bit so you guys are able to ask some questions. We've also got that number two icon, which is a green hand. If everybody would go ahead and hit that hand icon for me, just so I can make sure you guys can hear me okay. Go ahead and hit those hand icons for me, guys. That way I can make sure y'all can hear me. All right, thank you guys. And I can put them all down in one swoop. Thank you very much. All right, the next icon is gonna be the number three icon. That hand icon, by the way, you guys can use to, if I'm going too fast or if you want us to cover something a little more in detail, you can go ahead and throw that hand up. If you have any questions while we're going on here today, you can always type it into that number three icon, which is your question box. Uh, might be number four for some people. Um, you're more than welcome at any time to type in your questions. I keep them up at all times and be happy to answer them for you. Some people might have a camera icon. We are going to keep the cameras off today just because it does take up a lot of bandwidth for people in the more rural areas. We want to make sure everybody's able to hear us okay. So just a little bit of information about our school before we hand over the reins to Donnie. Um, we were incorporated in 1978 as a proprietary post-secondary vocational education institution. We are committed to providing a strong curricula with programs that emphasize practical, usable skills blended with a relevant general education foundation. We do have a caring environment, personal attention, and close faculty-student interaction with our open door admission policy. We are Florida's oldest private with a state-of-the-art facility. We have our one and a quarter mile multi-lane highway that ensures a safer, more efficient training. And we've graduated over 40,000 students since 1978. You might ask yourself this question quite often, why drive a truck for a living? The simple answer is gonna be job security. And speaking of job security, at this time, I would like to invite Mr. Johnny to take the reins and tell us all about Windy Hill Foliage. Thanks for coming on, Donnie. Can you hear me? We sure can. Oh, thank you so much for having me, um, Kayla. I appreciate the school let me come in and talk to you guys. And the nice thing is you've picked a great school. This is a, an awesome place. National Training does a fabulous job of preparing you for the industry. And I appreciate them partnering with us and allowing Wendy Hill to come in and recruit the students. The nice thing is they give you a lot of options. So no matter what company you choose to go with, and they have multiple companies that come in and talk to the students, uh, they've all been vetted through National Training. So you know, they have a, a mile and a quarter track there, I believe on, how many acres is it there, Kayla? 300, 350 acres. It's a huge, it 350 is. acres, mile and a quarter track. We lost you, Donnie. Oh, there you go. So they do a fabulous job of preparing you. And the nice thing is, um, once you get through national training, if you decided you wanted to come with Windy Hill, the nice thing is I'm the one doing the hiring. So I, I would take a look at your driving record, um, all that stuff ahead of time, criminal background. We go take everything on a case by case basis. 
and we can make that decision uh, and get you working. What we do is we put you out there for four weeks of pay training, and we're just going to build on the education you're getting at national training. Uh, we pay you $600 a week while you're in training. During that time, you'll get the hang of everything, dealing with shippers, receivers, our main lanes of travel. We run the Midwest and the Southeast, so you're gonna get a lot of variety. Uh, we don't have anything dedicated or regional, but we're the next best thing to regional. So you're gonna see a lot of repeat customers, uh, no New England, no New York states. I know that doesn't mean a lot now, but it will when you guys get out there and start driving. We offer all the same benefits as, as the big companies do, but we are a small family-owned business. Uh, Jack and Janice started this company in the late 70s as a, a flower business. They grow flowers, put them in a box truck, and take them up to Wisconsin and, and sell them. And they realized, man, there's a lot of money in this transportation. So they sold off the, um, the, the flower side and the foliage side to concentrate on transportation. So we've just grown modestly over the years we've got about 150 tractors and 300 trailers you guys are coming in at a great time if you decide to come to windy hill they just retired every couple years they'll retire a set of trucks and then add more to the fleet and they just retired 20 trucks and they added 30 new ones to the fleet so and all the new ones uh, are automatic so i believe now we're about 70 percent maybe 80 percent automatic trucks so uh, if you've got that automatic restriction or you're struggling with that shifting, no problem. Um, we'll we'll get you going. We'll put you in an automatic. We do have 10 speed. So if you're still interested in that, you know, some of our old school drivers or old hang ons, they love to those 10 speeds. So uh, and you're going to get training at national for both, whichever you prefer. So they, they give you a lot of options there. Types of freight we haul. If you guys are from Florida or been here any length of time, you know, Florida, the only thing it's producing is retirees. We're not an industry-based state. So what Wendy Hill has developed is we're pulling multi-stop garden center loads out of Florida. Going to like Walmart loads, Home Depot, there's, there's some extra money involved in those loads because you have to tailgate the product. I know I'm giving you a lot of new terms, but uh, tailgate the product, you have to hop up in the back of the trailer open the back doors, get the product to the back, and the stores will take it off with a forklift, um, and you just shut the doors and go to the next one. So there's a little bit of labor, but they pay you extra. It's either 25 or $50 a stop. So there's a lot of money to be made in the stop pay. Nice. Uh, once, you, once you're out of training, we start our drivers at up to 51 cents a mile. So the base pays 46, so 46 cents a mile is paid, loaded, or empty, and then they're giving you up to five cents in bonuses, or shall I say you're earning up to five cents in bonuses. Just depends on how well you're doing. It's a bar of excellence, the company set. Uh, so these guys, your first year with us, you should make 55, 65,000, no problem. Uh, somewhere in that range, uh, if you're a hard worker and a go-getter. But we are a smaller family-owned business, but we have all the same benefits. I see she's got the benefit page up there. Easy pass, dogs are welcome, rider policy, you can take your wife or your girlfriend, they're, they're pretty relaxed with that. Health insurance, vision, dental, short-term disability, long-term disability, all that stuff. So 401k will match, you put in $4, we'll put in two. We also have tuition reimbursement. So if you come to us directly out of national, they'll pay you back up to $5,000. They pay you directly. So uh, it's just an added bonus. Um, to encourage you to come to, to Windy Hill from national training. So I'm sure I've missed some some things, but do you guys have any questions for me? Or Kayla, do you have any questions? Anything you can think of that I've missed? Yeah, Donnie, what kind, what kind of equipment do you guys have? Like the different types of trucks or trailers that you guys have for, on your fleet? I'm having a lot of trouble with your audio, Kayla. Can you hear me? That now I can. Okay. What kind of what kind of equipment do you guys have? What kind of trailers or, or tractors do you guys have? Sure, we have International Pro Stars. They've just pulled most of those off. So the bulk of our fleet's going to be an automatic truck, Volvo Automatics, and we have, I think they've got five internationals left. 
and a few Freightliner Columbias, and they just bought some brand new international big sleeper trucks. So we've got a variety, International Pro Stars, Freightliner Columbias. But the bulk of the fleet is Volvos, which are automatics, and those things are really, really nice. So they've got one pictured there. Uh, we're, we're pulling 53-foot drive-ins, same trailer that you're going to be practicing with and backing there at national training uh, is, is what we're, we're hauling, 53-foot drive-ins. They do have a space saver reefer on the nose, but that's just to keep the plants temperature controlled. Uh, so, you know, they're, they're light wooden floor drive-ins. They're not like the corrugated, insulated, uh, refrigerated units. So it's, awesome. it's dry van. So it's plants leaving Florida and then any type of dry goods once you're done with that. It could be beer, rice, dog food, machine parts, just any type of dry goods, whatever's paying we're pulling. We're, we're not picky. Absolutely. Go where the money is, right? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And these guys do make really good money out there. So, uh, but your first step is to get into national and, uh, and get that license because, you know, they just changed the law last year. As of February, you have to go somewhere and get entry level driver training. And uh, luckily, National was already on the registry. So, absolutely. Perfect place to go. <laughs> awesome. Well, let's go ahead and open up some phone lines to some questions. Um, if anybody has their, any questions, go ahead and raise your hand. I'll be happy to click on you so you guys can ask away, or you can type it into the question box if that's easier for you. I see some of you might not have a microphone. Um, we did get one question in the typed in questions. I know you, they saw, they heard that you guys have a dog policy. Is there a size limit on the dogs that are allowed? Yes, they have to have all their shots be up to date and it's 50 pounds. Okay, so pretty good size pup. And then another question I got, uh, is there any military benefit with you guys? Yes, we'll start you out a penny higher on the pay scale if with a, you know, clean DD-214 or, or an honorable discharge. Yes, and we do want to thank you for your service to our country. Absolutely, always thank our veterans. Yes, uh, yes. Uh, let's see here. I see some people are typing, so we'll give them a minute to type their questions away. Yeah, no problem. Uh, what kind of home time? That's like another good question. What kind of home time can people expect? That's a great question, and you know, I'm, I can't believe I didn't answer that already. Uh, we're out three weeks at a time. Well, probably because I don't want to tell you, you have to stay out three weeks. Three okay. weeks is our minimum time out. And after three weeks, you can take up to seven days off. So you can take okay. three weeks out and take one week off. Really? Uh, and that, that's been very, very popular. They've This year, uh, this year they have changed some of the, the way we do business. We're giving people more home time because we understand that, you know, that home time, that family time, we want it to be quality time. Absolutely. So we do keep you out there three weeks, 21 days minimum, but you can take up to seven days off after that. And right. you can st you can stay out longer if you like. You don't have to come home every seven days. I mean, every 21 days. You can stay out longer and, and accrue more time off. So that, that's a great question. And it, it's a big question, especially coming out of Florida. Mm -hmm. You know, Florida's not a big producer of anything. I mean, we get some Zephyr Hills water and some Plant City strawberries, but for the most <laughs> For the most part, there's 20.6 million people that live here. So there's a lot of goods coming in to service the needs of the people, but there's not a lot leaving. So um, they do keep you out there three weeks and you could take up to a week off. I know that's a, a long answer to a short question, but. I like the detail on it. Yeah, because I mean, that's kind of different than the norm that you see in the industry, which is like a two weeks on, two weeks out and then you're home for two or three days. So to go, you know, an extra week out and then you get a whole week whole week off you know that, that's a pretty good deal gives you some good home time it, it has been very popular and they just doubled the pay the stop pay for our plant loads it used to be uh 15 and 25 dollars now it's 25 and 50. yeah so that's, 50, that's new to me when you said that i was like oh I, <laughs> yeah awesome. even if you're doing 50 times 20 you're, you're looking at a thousand dollars in a couple of days and stop pay alone is it gonna be a little bit of work? Yes, but uh, is it gonna be worth it? It is, because these guys really, really like these uh, these plant loads and, and they pay very good. Uh, so it, it's, it's, just, it's just extra, it's icing on top of the cake and they're always paying your miles. 
miles are paid, loaded, or empty. That's something when you get into trucking, you need to really uh, ask because some companies change the mileage rate, whether you're loaded or empty. Windy Hill, it's the same. You know, 46 cent a mile base pay, loaded or empty, and then that five cents in bonus money. That's awesome. Um, we did get one more question in the questions box here. Um, what about anybody with a, a felony back on their background or any misdemeanors or anything on their background? Uh, I would say to call me and talk to me personally. I've got the the owner has given me a lot of leeway with that. I mean, we've got some guidelines we go by, but I want to talk to you on a personal. We take everything on a case by case basis. Uh, I've, I've even hired people on, on probation and, and whatnot. I mean, we try to steer clear of that, but it's not, it's one of those things that if you really want to work and you can be an asset to Wendy Hill, we want to try and help you get into the industry and get going. Um, but some of the people that have, you know, everybody's gotten in trouble every once in a while, just some of us haven't been caught yet. And that's usually when I raise my hand. Uh, so, uh, you know, we're, we're a very forgiving company and, I think sometimes, you know, people make mistakes and that's okay. We can work through We can work through a lot of that stuff. That's that's great to hear. So what's the best way for a, a driver interested um, in your company to apply for them? Is it the, this apply now on, on your website that we're seeing here? I would say apply online and then I would say call the office. I, I can't stress that enough. Call the office, ask for Donnie. I'm there most days. Uh, if you're in national training, I'm going to be there this Thursday and this Saturday. Yeah. Um, so you can pull me aside, talk to me about your, your background, and I can I can tell you if it's a it's yay or nay, we can try to work through that. Uh, your driving record is very, very important. And national training takes a look at your driving record before they even let you in. So um, sometimes we're a little stricter than, than some other companies just because we're a smaller family owned business and insurance is very tight. Uh, but I can look at your driving record fairly quickly and tell you if it's yes or no, just by, you know, it's the driving record is what it is. Criminal background, I got some wiggle room and I can I can work on that. But the Absolutely. driving record's kind of written in stone. Absolutely. And that's why we're so diligent on it as well. Well, Donnie, I don't I don't see anybody raising their hands and I don't see anybody typing any more questions. So as always, well, I thank you for joining us. I thank you so much for having me on, Kayla. If there's ever anything I can do for you guys, just call me. Uh, you, I'll be in the office all day tomorrow. You can call and say, hey, I, I heard you on the, the webinar, and I want you to run my driving record. Just put the application in there. I can run it. I can talk to you. And if you have any questions that you want to ask me on a personal basis, I can do that too. Absolutely. We appreciate you taking the time out of your evening to join us tonight, Donnie, and I'll see you Thursday. Yes, ma'am. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a great evening. Bye-bye. All right, guys. So to continue on with our little webinar for the next few minutes, we're going to go through a few more things here. So a little bit about our school. Our trucks, we've had thousands of their very first driving experience, truck driving experience, rather, and our trucks. We have everything from cab over engines with a sleeper to conventional condos and sleepers and day cabs. If you've never seen the inside of a tractor trailer, um, your traditional one might look a little something like this. It's gonna have your driver's seat and your co-pilot seat. Most time those will swivel around just to give you a little more seating room, a little more wiggle room back in that sleeper cab. Some of them have a bunk that's gonna be similar to this one where it folds up into a dining area and then you put the table down and slide the cushions down and make yourself a bed. Usually they have great seats for their drivers. You know, they, they want you to be comfortable. You're in this driver's seat for 11, 12 hours a day. So they wanna make sure that you're comfortable while you're in that seat. A lot of them come equipped with a TV or microwave, mini fridge, um, power inverters. So you're able to plug your, your normal household items into those outlets. Driving jobs. You can haul freights of all kinds. There's a little bit of everything out there. You know, pretty much 90% or more of everything you've ever touched has been on a truck at one point or another. So just think about all the different things that you encounter on a daily basis and how many of those have been on a truck at some point. You can remain in primarily a specified area of the country if you like, or you can choose to do a route that you're, you know, looking at all lower 48 states. 
Some companies have even go into Canada. Most companies are going to offer options of weekly home time. Every company's got great pay, steady runs, company benefits. So the driver pay scale, this is based off of the Bureau of Labor and Statistics in 2019 to 2020. Uh, so honestly, I would feel like even this is on a, on a lower end, just based off of the feedback that I'm getting from our alumni and the companies that we deal with. Um, your average annual salary as a general freight trucker is about 46250 And like I said, that's on the lower scale. We just got to go with what has been posted by the Bureau of Labor and Statistics. Our school qualifications, we are going to review your driving record, as Donnie mentioned, as well as your criminal background, your physical abilities, and administer a drug screen on the very first day of school. And it's mostly important that we want you to know, we want to know your intensities to succeed. We ensure that you can benefit from this training before you start. And by doing so, we want, we're making sure that you're employable. Because that is the ultimate goal here, right, is to have gainful employment. We do have a four week residence hands on training. You're going to have an instructor in the cab with you. Our campus, as we were mentioning earlier, Donnie kind of elaborated on for me too. We have a 350 acre campus with this awesome one and a quarter mile track here. So this is where you're going to learn how to drive those tractor trailers. You can even see some of the trucks going around the track here. Um, it's a great, great facility and it makes a huge difference having this this track here to learn how to drive that tractor trailer before you ever leave the property. We also have a state of the art simulator that we utilize for our classes. We utilize it a lot for backing maneuvers. Um, it's just a great tool. You can do everything from, like you said, the backing to driving on a road to dealing with traffic. We can make the elements change and make it start raining or snowing, you know, make you have a, a flat tire to be able to evaluate you and see how you would handle a crisis. We do have a career services department and our placement process. We've been perfecting our graduate to work program for over 43 years, and it really does work. We start working with the students on the very first day of resident training school. We use one on one private counseling sessions to direct our students to companies that would be a good match for both the company and the student, because ultimately when you leave here, we want you to stick with the company for at least a year. Once you have that year of experience, all the doors in the world are open for you. We also have a job board for all of our alumni, truckschool.com slash jobs, and we update that weekly. And it's not just local jobs here to the Jacksonville or Green Cove Springs, Florida area. It's throughout the country. So it doesn't matter where you might live, you can hop on our job board and see what's hiring. Tons and tons of opportunity there. You might ask yourself, where do you stay if you're coming from out of town? We do have students that come from out of town um, and even out of state. You can really stay anywhere you want, but if you're looking for the best deal, we definitely suggest the Green Cove Springs Inn. It's located about seven miles from our training grounds. Um, all the rooms have a microwave, refrigerator, uh, free cable with HBO and free really fast Wi-Fi. They do have special rates for our students. A double occupancy room is 902 for the four weeks, which breaks down to about $34 a night. Um, single occupancy room is going to be $12.89 for the four weeks that you're here in school. Cost fees and financing for our CDL Now program. The tuition is $7,495. <clears throat> there are a couple of other out-of-pocket expenses, um, like your drug testing, your state driving tests, that your admissions advisor would be more than happy to discuss with you. We do offer multiple types of financing as well. We have outside financing with banks and credit unions. We also work with workforce, vocational rehab, veterans, um, TAA, income share agreements, more specifically MIA share, we partner with them. Um, we also have in-house financing. And as Donnie mentioned, a lot of companies are gonna offer you tuition reimbursement or they're gonna pay you back for coming to school. After all, we've been doing this for a very long time. It's all good. We have it all. We have companies in the jobs. We have the industry recognition. We have impeccable governmental relations. We have guaranteed tuition financing for everyone. We have over 40,000 graduates that came possibly before you. We have a program that is really fun to complete. 
and we have an awesome training facility. We always appreciate the students from the Department of Veterans Affairs, Department of Vocational Rehab Programs, State Vocational Rehab Programs, State Workforce Programs, and the Bureau of Indian Affairs. National training is where the trucking companies come for new drivers. So in addition to Windy Hill, we have tons of different companies that we partner with and we, do, we work with, over 150 to be exact. Um, usually with each class, you know, you're going to see about six to 10 different companies that will come and actually talk to you while you're here in school. So as long as you're applying for companies while you're here, you should have no problem finding a job. At this time, I'd like to open up the phone lines to any questions that you might have, whether it be regarding our school um, or Windy Hill. I can usually answer most of their questions. So if you have any questions, go ahead and raise your hand. I'll be happy to call on you. Any questions at all? Give you guys a few moments and we'll go over a couple more things before we take off for the evening. I do have a few special announcements I'd like to make. Our next webinar is going to be two weeks from today on July 19th at 6.30 p.m. Our special guest that evening will be Covenant, with, and that's Frank Bradley, who we deal with with them. Great guy. I think you guys will really enjoy listening to Frank talk about his company. Um, so definitely invite you guys to join us in two weeks. As Donnie mentioned, he'll be here Saturday. We have an open house event this Saturday from 9 to 12 highly encourage anybody who's you know within driving distance to definitely come in and take a look you're going to get a tour of our facility we'll even put you up in one of our trucks and take you for a ride and we'll even take you out to our heavy equipment operating area and let you jump on a piece of equipment too so it's a lot of fun bring your family your friends we usually have donuts and coffee um, go over a few things we'll let you jump up on the simulator and drive that as well so it's a great time Great way to spend Saturday morning. We would love to have you guys out. I'd like to thank all of you guys for joining us tonight. Contact your representative or our first thing tomorrow. The 1-800 number is 1-800-488-7364. Or you can call us. The local number is 904-272-4000. Your lost time is costing you big money. It's all good. Just make sure you give us a call. Thank you guys so much for attending tonight. In order to sign off of the webinar, you can go to File, Exit, Leave Webinar. It's File, Exit, Leave Webinar. Thank you guys so much for joining me tonight, and I really appreciate you again in two weeks.